Okay, my name is Gabriel. I do a, a promoter for the Butterfly Tour in Berlin organization. Hey, my name is Patrick Di Stefano. I'm a, uh, I'm a DJ of Butterflies. And artistic director. And artistic director. Electronic scene in Turin is uh, uh, very rooted. Uh, there is a long-lasting uh, history with electronic music. Uh, I think we have in Turin one of the uh, best Italian festivals related to uh, uh, the electronic music. Uh, there is Club to Club that just happened, which was just in November, uh, which attracted about 25,000 people. So we have uh, really a long-lasting culture of electronic music. Uh, a lot of people are uh, following the music, they understand it, they uh, have a very deep knowledge of the artists. And in this scene, uh, we created uh, Butterfly as an event that started out of a private event about four years ago. And the idea was to uh, essentially virtually connect the city of Torino and the city of Berlin, which are connected on several ways, also cult culturally and artistically speaking. So we wanted to create a virtual flight, so to say, that uh, takes uh, the whole uh, invited people to the party virtually to Berlin. Uh, so in this we, we do uh, recreating the atmosphere of Berlin into the uh, uh, locations that we select for our parties. Well, producers in Torino, uh, I think we have a lot. Uh, yeah, maybe we can think about some names. Yeah, from uh, from Hugo, from uh, Franco Cazzola, from uh, Reels, from uh, so Hugo is from uh, Mobile. Yes, not only. Uh, not only, but uh, mainly I think he got mainly famous for Mobile. Uh, Franco Cazzola. Uh, recently, it's Aponio. Aponio. Right. was recently published on uh, Sound of, uh, oh, well, I think the latest uh, Sven Fates compilation. Uh, Reels from Olin and uh, Marcelo has, uh, I think, his own label, yeah. Carnival Records. Carnival Records. Uh, so we have a lot of uh, Sheen, uh, yeah. a good uh, electronic scene, and mostly these people we are, and these artists are well known in. Uh, uh, abroad, they are more known abroad than they are uh, than they are here in Torino. So, if actually they want to get uh, famous and more known, they normally have to go outside and uh, and play outside of uh, Italy. Um, well, I said before that uh, uh, Butterfly was born out of a, of a private party, so that's the idea that we try to, uh, to keep, essentially, going forward. We are trying to do this uh, by organizing events, so concentrating more on events and less on a, on a fixed schedule of uh, appointments, maybe in the same club. What we do is we change always the situation, it's uh, always a different place, maybe sometimes it's not even a club. It's just a, uh, a box that we like and we think it fits with the story that we want to tell. Very often this story includes not only music, but it also includes other forms of art. So we like to couple art, uh, musical art with uh, uh, other artistic expressions, with culture, with uh, photograph, uh, with uh, visual artists, 
and uh, lots of other things. So fortunately, a lot of our uh, friends and uh, customers, if you like, uh, belong uh, to the artistic world. And so there is a lot of synergy going on. And we see this really going on. We get it, I think now, we have a good credibility also. And uh, we get spontaneous propositions to uh, uh, join the project and to bring some new energy and ideas into it. And so we think we will deploy this uh, moving forward with uh, uh, maybe bigger events where we try to uh, uh, essentially really tell a complete story about not only about clubbing but about artistic expression in general uh, and also smaller events where we want to invite uh, interesting and fresh artists from Berlin which is our our uh, love city basically and, uh, and try to make them known to our city so maybe even if they are not yet very famous maybe they didn't play yet uh, in, uh, in Torino we'd like to give them a chance and uh, essentially show all the talents that uh, are available in a city like uh, Berlin to, uh, to our friends here in Torino.